Hey guys, this is Skull Knight 43. This is a domination ground war on grid. Um, I started off using the sniper, but uh, I switched to the AUG later in the game. Um, the perks I use on the AUG, uh, I, I switched to the AUG very soon. I switched to the AUG, um, and my perks are, let's see, I believe it is Flak Jacket, Not Pro, Steady Aim, Not Pro, and Hacker Pro. But you can uh, see if that's true, I don't know. Um, my kill streaks for this game are the UAV, the Blackbird, and the Gunship. I am using the gunship because I'm trying. I was trying to get a contract, and uh, I was really trying to. I wanted to go ahead and get that so I could get a different contract. So uh, that's why I, I kind of try hard for the gunship, and uh, you'll see uh, what happens. But uh, anyways, um, today I would like to talk to you guys. I, I do, first off, I do badly in this game um, early on, but it uh, it it uh, improves for me. Uh, so uh, don't worry. Anyways, um, I'm not gonna talk about that. Um, the game too much today. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys about what you guys want to see. So I'm doing two Let's Plays and I'm trying to uh, upload those. I'm trying to do like at least one video a day, but that's kind of tricky with school and I can't always do that. Um, I've been uploading like two or three videos of StarCraft and, um, at once, but I'm gonna I'm gonna stop doing that. Um, and same with the Fallout Let's Play. I'm I'm doing I'm gonna start doing uh, one video a day because. The way it is, it's going to turn out is I'm pretty much only going to be able to record sessions on weekends, and that weekend session is going to have to last until the next weekend session or the next time I record. So I'm probably going to end up uploading one uh, video a day, but that that you know that'll be good. That'll give you guys plenty of time, and I won't be flooding you guys. So, um, anyways, what that means though is that with two other uh, two very large projects, I don't have much time um, for doing gameplay. So the ones I do, I want I want you guys to really like them. So I'm trying to get more on the gameplay uh, mindset. I'm trying to uh, be less cautious because that's looked down upon. I mean, sometimes if you're trying to do a get, get a good game, I mean, you're cautious. And uh, and that's just, you know, a fact of life, a fact of Call of Duty. And uh, right here, I'm using Hacker Pro to booby trap the care package. Um, anyways, uh, so, and... Even though that will help me get a good game, that doesn't necessarily make a good game as far as uh, YouTube goes. So I'm trying to get more in the mindset of uh, playing for recording. Um, so that means like not camping, you know, using different weapons. I'm probably going to start using some uh, camos to make it a little bit more aesthetically pleasing for you guys. You know, stuff like that. But uh, anyways, I want to make the multi, or at least the uh, non-Let's Play episode videos like special those are like the things I won't do as much maybe once or twice a week I'll upload one of those so I want those to be extra good so like kind of something to look forward to so um, I wanted to make to make sure that you guys like whatever it is so that if that means good game um, then so be it but some people I don't know I want to know what you guys want to see for these more special uh, videos because I spend more time on these because um, these are post and all that um, so do you guys want to see Black Ops multiplayer? Because um, I can continue putting out good games like this. Um, I have a good amount of good games left. Um, so, I mean, I can keep doing these if you want. Or, if you guys want, I can do some live commentary wager matches. Maybe do a high roller. A lot of commentators are doing that. I don't know if you guys are sick of that, though. Um, I mean, whatever. And look at this grenade. This is a very well-placed grenade, in my opinion. I don't know how that ain't kill that guy. I didn't even get a hit marker. I thought that was a well-placed grenade, but I guess not. Maybe it exploded too early. I don't know. But, uh, anyways, back to what I was saying. Um, oh, right here I've run out of ammo, so my friend kills himself, and I pick up his gun. Um, anyways. So, uh, what do you guys want to see? I could do this. I could do live commentary, wager matches. Oh, I could do some solo zombies. And solo zombies isn't going to be like a... Like a, the other zombies I did, it's not gonna be a multiple parts. It'll probably be one, maybe two videos. Um, Cause what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna record the early stuff, cause that's pretty boring. And you guys, that's I mean, it's pretty much just knife them until round five, and then you know, I mean, stuff like that. It, it gets, it can get boring. So um, uh, what I think I was doing is I, I think I'm gonna record a solo zombie session. Um, once I get to around 25 plus. So once I get to around 25, I turn on the recording and uh, see what happens. Because uh, I can show you guys what I do for solo zombies. 
Um, it's a well-known strategy, but I'll show you guys like how I do it if you guys don't know. It's a, it's a very good strategy, but uh, anyways, I get my gunship here, finally, after some very cautious play and running out of ammo, but I finally get it thanks to a very kind friend. But uh, I am playing with someone else. It doesn't appear as a blue triangle because I think I joined his session in progress, but I'm not sure. So I call on the ch uh, gunship, and the gunship is, I don't know, it's very surprising to me. I was surprised how well this gunship did. Because Grid seems like a very indoor map. It kind of seems like a... Uh, it's somewhat reminiscent of the Derail map. Where, um, although there's plenty of outside, most people stay... There's like two inside buildings where a lot of the action happens. And that's what I kind of thought of this. But uh, as it turns out, a lot of people were outside. And I guess they were spawning outside, which didn't help them. But uh, I don't know. It, it did a lot better than I expected. I just go on a beastly tear. I get... Multiple doubles. I think I, I I start off with a quad on it, which is always a good sign. And this is why I love ground world. There's so many people. You get so many like double kills and triples and quads. It's just so much potential, especially if they don't shoot it down. Like I think, yeah, that right here, someone targets me. I kill him before he can uh, shoot anything, and no one else targets me for the rest of this gunship, which is just insanely rape. But uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, so. Comment in the section what you got in the comment section below what you guys want to see. Um, I can, you know, do whatever. Like these videos are a little more special. I spend more time on these generally, and I, I want them to be good quality. So I want them to be something you guys are gonna like. And if you see right there, I saw on the mini map three people. I'm like, oh man, this is my chance for glory. So I prime my grenade, try and get revenge on that earlier grenade, and I get a triple. So that's uh, that's always nice when you get those grenade triples. But, uh, what's, what is your uh, guys' opinion on the frag versus syntax debate? I personally prefer the frag just because it's kind of a, I don't know, I kind of like cooking grenades. Makes it, it seems a little bit more skillful, and the frag grenade, um, is a little bit more powerful. It has, it does the same damage, um, total than the syntax, but the syntax damage fades over a shorter distance, which means, um, at... A uh, five foot away from a frag grenade, you'll take more damage than if you're five foot away from a syntax. So uh, I, that's why I use frags mainly for the extra damage, and uh, they do have the same blast radius though. Um, there's a, a good video review of that um, by T Mountain, so you guys should go check that out if you're in, more interested in the uh, very detail, very, very detailed uh, verses of those two. But uh, yeah. Uh, Okay, I hate Last Stand. You, you guys saw that guy. That guy was in Last Stand. I hate Last Stand. I don't think there has been a single game with Last Stand in it where that game didn't get flack about Last Stand. Like, honestly, Last Stand just annoys me so much. Because if it's not... It's not so much that I have to put extra bullets. It's what happens because I have to put extra bullets in. Like... I, I don't think I, I rarely, rarely get killed by uh, someone in second chance. Unless I, like, run out of ammo and I'm out in the open and they have a python or something like that. But, um, I rarely die from second chance. What I hate is, if I see two people, I shoot one, that person's in second chance, I can't move on to the next target. And that guy has extra time to kill me, plus any damage I take from the second chance guy, um, while he's in second chance. Which really annoys me. Um... And people, I'll take a guy out, someone else will put one bullet to them, and they get the kill. I think that is BS. They did, they put one bullet into that guy. I put four to five bullets into that guy to take, put him into the last stand. And my friend just walks up, puts one bullet into him, and gets the kill. I have always said this, and I maintain that I think um, the last stand, if you kill someone in last stand that you did not put into last stand, you should get the assist. And the other person should get the kill. Because they did all the work. You just cleaned it up for them. I mean, I understand giving that person the kill. But they didn't des that the other person deserved the kill. It was just the perk that stopped him from getting the kill. Which, I mean, I guess that's the same that, that Juggernaut did. But still, I disagree with. But uh, this game's wrapping up. Um, I got two unnecessary deaths at the end. And uh, my final score is 76 and 8, I believe. And I have a bonus clip at the end of this video, so I'm just gonna stop the audio and let you guys listen, see that. Um, it's a RC car glitch, but uh, thank you guys for watching and have a nice day.
Friendly RCXD inbound. Heads up, enemy RCXD spotted. Securing B. Eyes on the 